Hello and welcome to another tool introduction. Today I want to show you a simple tool called IBK Helper. This tool will uh, help us with the IBK keying process and I'm sure everybody of you uh, knows about this IBK color stack thing. And even if not, I want to take a minute and explain this to you. So when we want to do a soft key, like key a half transparent object or hair or uh, like the focus stuff, uh, we, uh, we usually use uh, IBK and uh, it gives us uh, a decent key. And what we want to do is make a clean plate and this IBK gizmo took a clean plate like I have here and a plate with our objects that we want to key and it's like doing something like a difference key and we are getting a clean alpha from it. So uh, you can imagine this uh, keying process as, uh, as a cleanup, uh, but cleanup in reverse. For example, uh, when you are doing cleanup, you want to uh, remove an unwanted object from your, uh, from your plate but but here uh, you want to do the opposite and uh, remove the object that you want to keep uh, in the end for me it's for example this guy and uh, you want to do a, a cleanup so uh, this is my clean plate for uh, for his head and when i just plug this clean plate here and look into alpha i can see that uh, where I have the, the clean plate, I get a good alpha. But sometimes doing the cleanup can be a very time-consuming task. Uh, so we do it procedurally with this uh, IBK color. And uh, how this IBK color uh, works, uh, you can imagine it like a basic edge extension. For example, I, I make a hole here. I make a hole for his head. And I want to fill this hole with the values from this edge. I put a blur node blur it and unprint mode and I can uh, do, uh, put this uh, blur and unprint mode under my plate with a hole under and uh, this this will fill uh, fill that hole uh, with the values from the edge and the basic IBK color does the same first uh, we need to select the screen type and adjust these values to to make our uh, subjects that we want to key black by adjusting the values and uh, I changed the, the values and uh, here is my, my subjects are black and uh, I want to uh, change this uh, patch black value and also the size uh, it, it will uh, do a blur but when we change these values it will uh, blur uh, and average everything like when we s look at this blur we, we can see it uh, better uh, for example uh, if I have a smaller value on the blur size I can see that this, this line uh, is not uh, is staying sharp is not it's not that um, averaged uh, but when i increase this value it uh, averages everything uh, around it and our clean plate will not be as good so we don't want to blur it too much that's why we are using multiple uh, ibk colors to iteratively uh, blur it like uh, gradually um, increasing the values for example here i have uh, a value of one which is which uh, does uh, this for a couple of pixels and uh, then I, uh, I do a bigger fills and uh, after uh, a couple of uh, IBKs I, I fill um, the, the holes and now I can uh, use my IBK gizmo uh, to, key, to key this and I get a good edges and this works uh, with an animation too. So let's get back to our tool and what this tool does, it replaces the, the whole process uh, with one node and this is actually faster because it uses this uh, blur and, and promote technique internally and we don't use so many IBK colors. So let's look at it. First of all, when you just plug it, uh, it is uh, the interface is uh, basically the same as in the IBK color node. You can select a clean uh, screen type and also select the values like light and dark values um, I will copy them from this one node um, and I made my uh, subjects black but uh, for example sometimes you you want to leave as much uh, greens green screen intact as possible and take all uh, all the pixels from your subjects uh, and uh, to do that sometimes uh, you need to uh, change these values and also I have an erode here that will erode this black patch and uh, also uh, I can increase this value a bit uh, to get rid of unwanted ha hair uh, but this will mean that I'm eating away also a green screen like uh, you can see a green values here and 
when I increase this, it, uh, it's, it's that uh, green. And this will mean more averaging and uh, the key will, will not uh, end worse key. Also, I have a little uh, hair here, uh, but uh, let's, let's just look at the result. I'm increasing this patch black here and it will uh, fill the blacks. I can click uh, this IBK gizmo uh, here and it will create a gizmo for me and I can see the alpha, it's a good alpha. But uh, sometimes we can't get rid of everything with these values and we, we need to have like, we, we want to draw uh, uh, some additional masks maybe. For that we have this uh, additional matte input. If I draw a shape here and connect it to additional matte, uh, it will uh, make make this part black. Uh, also, I can connect any any type of alpha here. For example, for now, I just want to get rid of the, uh, the these couple of hairs. And when I patch this, it will uh, give me a better alpha here than uh, without that, with this hair. But sometimes we want to use a custom alpha, uh, and uh, we can make a make a quick alpha using, for example, a primate node. This alpha needs uh, needs to be a hard alpha, like uh, like a hard a hard key. In our IBK helper, let's uh, click this this custom mat um, checkbox and connect this to our primate, and uh, we can see the black patch now. Uh, it's using the alpha from this primate. You can change this alpha any way you want. You can, for example, erode it and like do basically what you, what you want. I have an erode here that I can use, uh, and I can uh, patch this black. Uh, I did a very bad job keying this uh, hair, uh, so th this will not be a best key uh, because uh, I uh, I cut all my hair. But but you got the point. So uh, this node also have uh, this button split output, and this will give you two different outputs. One called a clear screen that we saw is just a clean plate, and the second one is called screen prep, and uh, it's it's like a one colored green screen uh, that may be. Uh, useful uh, like when you have green screen with uh, difference in lighting and or uh, the green screen ha has uh, many folds for example like here this will even out your green screen and after after doing this you can uh, use uh, a key or like a key light to to do your key uh, that's it for this tool you can download this tool from the link in the description thank you for watching bye bye